How's your week been so far, Nick? It's been an incredibly intense week. It's been amazing to bring so many people, 10,000 people from our financial community uh, together and obviously back together uh, in person in addition to being digital this year. At Cybos, innovation is everywhere. So just since you've been here this week, what have been some of your favorite pieces of innovation that you've seen? There have been over 20 innovation focused sessions that, that we've helped facilitate and many, many more that are touching on it on innovation topics and really diverse topics that um, people care about across the industry from uh, the fantastic response to Swift's uh, new AI platform through to uh, discussions about how we're solving for corporate actions and securities and how also institutions are innovating to digitize trade. So moving on to CBDCs and tokenized assets, uh, it's an area that's been gaining uh, quite a bit of momentum. What do you think is driving this and uh, what are some of the challenges to adoption? Now with over 100 central banks exploring CBDCs and nine uh, already live, we've reached a stage now where uh, central banks and commercial banks are not just asking the questions about the what and the why of CBDCs, but actually getting deeply into the, the questions about how do we achieve CBDCs. And finally, can you just talk a bit about how SWIFT is helping to solve some of those challenges? Our focus is very much on interoperability between CBDCs to enable CBDCs to be used seamlessly and frictionlessly for cross-border payments. We announced uh, the results of the experiments that we've done on, on CBDCs, which have been incredibly well received. And in addition to that, we've also uh, announced uh, the opening up of our CBDC sandbox. So we now have 15 central and commercial banks working with us to test the experimental solution that, that we've developed. That will give us incredible insights uh, and feedback and enable us to go forward and develop a, a solution which we hope will be genuinely useful for the financial services industry.